To the Myrtle Beach Bowl, both teams have arrived and kind of settled into their hotels now as Georgia Southern is from uh, getting familiar to the area with uh, being obviously in the Sun Belt. They get to play Coastal Carolina every year, but at Brooks Stadium every other year. Uh, some of the teams, though, just kind of knowing how special this is to make a bowl game, travel with your team, try to win a trophy. The excitement just really in the air there at the press conference. So here are both head, co head coaches talking about their arrival at the beach. As we come out of the sky, you know, we come out, uh, you can see the beach line, and then we head out to the ocean, and uh, every window had, had a face, you know, planted, looking at the, out of both directions of the plane. And, and me and my wife were sitting there, and they just had a big smile. You know, to the victors go the spoils, and this is a spoil for us is in being here. So I'm so happy for them. Uh, I know when they hit the hotel and they saw the beach and they, it, they've gotten the bowl gifts and, and things like that, you know, it's exciting. You know, 18 to 21 year olds turn back into sixth graders and sometimes coaches do too. I, I, I felt it myself with our staff. So we're all excited to be here. And the Myrtle Beach Bowl is going to kick off bowl season Saturday at 11 a.m. We'll have some live updates for you in our morning show that day. Plus, we're going to go hand, uh, hang out with some of the teams at the Hangout on Friday. We'll have live coverage then as well as we continue that coverage all week long. But for now, that's going to do it for sports.